with, hey, this is Ron with the RadioLogitechnologies.com blog and YouTube channel. I'm going to do a quick video today, really short, uh, but I realized someone asked me a question on YouTube about a topic that I, I have mentioned more than once, but I've never really gone into detail about it. And the topic is the Wonderlick test. It is a, a simple, short test that um, some schools give you in the admissions uh, part of your application process. And I believe I've got some, I'm going to do some screen sharing with you. But just to get the ball rolling, I'm going to give you the short definition as uh, stated on Wiki. Uh, the Wonderlick Contemporary Cognitive Ability Test, formerly the Wonderlick Personnel Test, is a popular assessment used to measure the cognitive ability and problem-solving aptitude of prospective employees for a range of applications. This is the one that the uh, the NFL used to have the players take, um, and might might still take it. Um, so it's it's not necessarily a scientific or mathematical or you know heavy duty um, uh, assessment. It's more of a of a common sense approach. And I'll I'll show you some samples here in just a second. But um, it is a proprietary assessment created and distributed by Wonderlick. That's the company. The assessment is available in 12 different languages and is often used in all types of employment hiring from entry level to executive level. It consists of 50 multiple choice questions to be answered in 12 minutes. So it is a time test. The test was developed by Eldon Wonderlick. He was a uh, graduate student at Northwestern University. The score is calculated as the number of correct answers given in the allotted time. A score of 20 is in is intended to indicate average in, intelligence and so um this is one of those tests where you just want to answer the ones that you know and you don't want to waste time on ones you're not sure or don't know because if you get it wrong that that'll penalize you it's the number of correct answers in uh in the 12 minutes so let me hit the old screen share button here and i believe that's it right there share that there so this is the, uh, I just Googled it. Here, this is what you can do, it's super easy. The Wonderlick test sample. And if you don't know, there's a, a site called Quizlet that has just about anything and everything on it. Um, and sure enough, they have Wonderlick sample tests. You can see all of them. Uh, Quizlet, and I'm not, I'm not harking for Quizlet, I'm not some kind of affiliate there, but it's a place where people go and they just upload their stuff, um, their, their questions. And, um, this is an example of a 28 question Wonderlick sample test. Now, there's no guarantee that this is an actual Wonderlick test because again, it's on Quizlet, it's not on the Wonderlick site. And I bet if you went to the Wonderlick site, they probably have sample questions there. But um, I've seen these enough to know kind of what they look like. And here's a good example. If a uh, cup of pancake mix makes two pancakes, how many pancakes can be made with three cups of pancake mix? So that's a matter of straightforward um, multiplication, right? And you flip it over and it gives you the answer. And you can sit here and go through these questions and get an idea of what that looks like. Um, if I take out the word Quizlet, I bet. Um, this test guide says they have a free Wonderlick practice test. Uh, here's another one, beat the Wonderlick. So, you know, when I took the Wonderlick over 15 years ago for x-ray, um, you didn't have these websites. In fact, I don't think you had a whole lot of websites. But uh, now you have places you can go and, and see samples. Um, WonderlickTestPrep.com. Uh, so that that's what the Wonderlick is. This is just a quick, you know, what what is it? My school that I went to, at the time um, had several criteria for getting in. You had to uh, take an interview with the board or the, or the teachers at the school. Um, you had to write a little essay on why you wanted in. Uh, you had to take the Wonderlick. Um, you got points for other criteria, like at the time, if you were over 60 or something years old, you got a point. If you were a veteran, you got a point. Um, if you were reapplying because you didn't get in last time around, you got a point. But the Wonderlick was just one aspect of, 
what they use to kind of check your overall intelligence level. Like the description said, it's just a it's just a basic intelligence level type uh, type test. So don't let the wonder look freak out. It's not hard at all, and, and there's so many samples that you can Google um, that you should be able to see enough of to kind of get the basic idea. But it's it's kind of common sense stuff. It's not it's not uh, trig or calculus or uh, scientific formulas or not quoting any law, statutes, anything crazy. It's just straightforward. You you buy you buy something worth fifty cents and all you have is a dollar. How much change will you get back? It's just real common sense stuff. So that's what the one to look is. I hope it's been helpful. Make sure you hit the like button and subscribe if you haven't already so you'll know when I uh, put up these uh, YouTube videos for you. And if you have any other questions, uh, obviously I don't mind answering them. I've, I've got I'm probably on, I don't know, 60 videos by now or something like that. There's over 100 uh, articles on my blog, the radiologictechnologist.com, where I've answered tons and tons of questions. Uh, so if you can't find the answer on my blog, leave me a comment here and I'll be happy to answer it for you. If it's something simple, I'll just type a comment back to you. But if, it, if it's worthy of a little bit of a description, maybe some visual like this kind of was showing you where to go to get it and that kind of thing, I don't mind hopping on real quick. Uh, I, gra I grab my Diet Dr. Pepper, make sure the stupid mic's on because half the time I do this, the mic's off. And uh, I record it. There it is. Bada boom, bada bing. So I hope it's been helpful. See you guys later.